Anyways, everybody doing today, man? I hope y'all having a great day. Now, we got unforgettable family vacations. Now, personally, me, I don't do long car rides. And I see they got a car right here. I don't do car rides longer than I want to say, like, two, three hours after that. And I don't like height. So, I'm not going to get in the plane. So, I probably just won't go. But I want to see what she going to do, man. This, this should be interesting. Well, we did it. It took all day to get here. But by God, look at that beach. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start it over, I guess. Now. Well, we did it. It took all day to get here, but by golly, look at that beach. Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. <coughs> oh, God. Where's her stuff? Uh, I thought you packed it. I thought you packed it. I think family vacations often reflect our own family dynamics. It's a love-hate relationship. Look, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I don't Facts. believe it is possible to cram three or more humans into a little tiny container for hours without someone getting their seatbelt in a twist. The map reader reads the map wrong. There's not enough bathrooms left at the rest stop, and that is the only stop. Oh, this, the driver drives down. This must be an old story map. You just use, um, what's the thing, uh, Google Maps? And it tells you where to go. Huh? Down the wrong you gotta highway, read no map. The driveway. Your Game Boy goes red, and only then you forget your trying to Oh yeah, home. Game Boy. Yeah, this old. This old. Nope, cause she's evil. So you lose all the progress you made in Pokemon, and thus times like these births. I ain't gonna cap. That used to be the worst though. As, get your feet out of your brother's face. Or on face. Nintendo I can't DS. I have to tell you that. All I'm saying is, I don't know how they did it back in the old days. At least we know now there are some awesome things on the other end of this 12-hour drive. Yes, 12 hour drive. When I was about 11, we inherited a Jeep due to some unfortunate losses in the family. But we thought, all right, we'll take good care of this family car and hold on to it until Alyssa's old enough to drive it. And as a small town Southern gay, I was pretty excited about that Jeep. And for its first test, we were gonna drive it from our home in North Carolina up to New York. We packed it up, we backed it out. We got all the way up to New Jersey, just one state away from our destination. And it broke down. But then we got to ride in the tow truck. And that's like being in a really big Jeep. In the end, we made it to New York. Oh, okay, 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 okay. We got the slice. We slipped on ice. And we had a wonderful time. And as our lovely days up north came to a close, we remembered we had to drive all the way home. Yep. And it went I was just, just as well that. as you would expect. And thus, the Jeep was thankfully taken out back, put out of its misery, and sold for parts. May God rest his soul. But it's not all doom and gloom. There is no. one place, of course, that basically guarantees a good family vacation. And we went there in the prime of my youth, five years old. That's right. I'm talking about the park with the sparks, the mouse with the clubhouse, the original reason animators formed a union. Put your hands together for Disney. Though I was really young, so I only remember bits and pieces of it. But that's what photo albums are for. Don't remember that. Don't remember that. Definitely don't remember that. Oh, oh, hold on a second. I, I remember this dude. This waiter. What's that? Th what's, what's that? What's that called? Orlando Studios. I, th I think that's what it's called. Or Disney. Dis no, Disneyland. Disneyland. That's what it's called. Or Disney World or Disneyland. I went to whichever one is in Florida. I ain't never went to the one in Cali. But I remember going there back when I was like, I want to say I was like four maybe. I remember. And I remember the, lo the little princess was in the tower at the top. And I remember the cloud started coming in, and I thought it was real. And then she had the little, the, she had the little, the little wand, and she was pointed at the clouds and stuff. Oh, I tell you, bro, it scared me so bad. I didn't want to watch like cartoon Disney cartoon. I don't think I watched a Disney cartoon after I saw that. I don't think I watched another Disney cartoon till I was in like, I want to say second grade. So like. Four years, man. After, bro, it scared me so bad. I Your thought it was real. Like, oh, you better finish all the food on your plate. Your parents paid for that. And I was like, but I can't. I'm two foot eight. My stomach is the size of a clementine. I'm full. But he didn't care. He was so disappointed in me. But he also played Winnie the Pooh on guitar, and that was nice. I also remember riding the monorail a lot. How did Winnie the Pooh I go? It was a ride. <laughs> it was my favorite ride. <laughs> I ain't seen I that in a minute. I just really liked that I could sit there and look out the window and see all the people and all the rides, all the plants, and the buildings, and the lights. I don't know. That Naruto? I just... Bro, that's Naruto, Sasuke. I don't know these other people. 
That's supposed to be um Hakashi Hakashi? Hakashi Sensei? I think that's the name. I like okay, so let me I'll probably like, okay, yeah, you supposed to know these people. I literally just started watching Naruto like two or three weeks ago. Never seen it before. And I'm on I'm on season five or six. No, 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 no. I'm on season six. I'm on like episode ten. But yeah, but I've been binging Naruto for a while. But I, I like it. It's lit. I, I remember after, I was after the first season, but I was already doing the, the little silence. <laughs> I remember I walked up to my brother, my brother Ben seen it, and I walked up to him. I was like, um, is you or she told it? You know, you know how you do the little, the little hand signs and stuff? And then, my, <laughs> and then my brother started doing all the stuff back at me. And then I was like, water stuff, water dragon jutsu. But yeah, but it's like, I'm, I'm going to get back and cook it. I'm talking about extra stuff. Lights. I don't know. I've just been. Literally vibing since 2002. Oh, oh, I remember. This is why I liked it. Okay, the monorail. Since it's like the main mode of transportation for everyone in the park, it mm -hmm. ran 24-7. So, every night after my baby brother went to sleep, my dad and I would ride the monorail. Because it's still open, Dad! It never closes! Come on, we'll be first in line! We also went on the log flume in Space Mountain. And by we, I mean my dad and I, because my mom doesn't even trust a trampoline. And my baby brother was basically a flower sack with legs. But that little sack of flour wanted to ride Space Mountain so bad, he threw the biggest tantrum on Earth. And thus, we got this thingy from the park Fraternity saying he futures. could come back later when he's old enough and he'd be first in line to ride it. And guess who's got 20 candles on their birthday cake and doesn't like roller coasters? This guy. Me either, man. guess who still has an evil sister? We haven't been back since then, but to be honest... I remember the first time I got on a roller coaster, man. It was, this is my last time pausing the video or whatever. My first time riding a roller coaster, I was in seventh grade, and we was going to Six Flags. I had never rode a roller coaster before, but the whole time we was going, like my whole group, we all ready, because we got to be in a group to go. And we all talking about, oh, yeah, we going to ride this, ride this. I said, man, I ain't getting on the ride. I'm getting on the Goliath. The Goliath is the biggest roller coaster there. I don't like heights, and I don't, I don't like roller coasters. I've never been on one, but I don't like them. But... My group talking, man, and me, I don't know when to shut up. And so I'm sitting there, man, and we all talking, we talking, and we get there. Long story short, I was crying by the time I got off. I'm not sure I would go. Since I moved to California <laughs> in 2015, I've been to Disneyland a couple times, and wow, nostalgia is one heck of a drug. <laughs> now that I must pay for goods and services, I see why that guy made me feel so bad for not eating my Disney price spaghetti. Look at the price. Please don't eat with your eyes. And they call Vocals. It being an adult. I've often heard the phrase, it's not about the destination, it's about the journey. Mm. But I have to disagree when it comes to family vacations. No matter how much you love your family, the journey will always be the worst part. And let's be real, sometimes even the destination isn't worth it either. Family vacations are just about... Being together and making memories, I guess. Good or bad. Yeah. Because in the end, Facts. years later, you're going to look back and laugh. And that's how you know it'll all have been worth it. That's Wait a second. You... Is that the brother? That don't look nothing like the... But it done changed his hair up or something? No, never mind. I don't... Nah, this, this ain't neither one of them. This must... She must have got an older sister or something. Cause these folk. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm looking at all the extra stuff. But man, I done had a few family vac vacations of my own, man. But I think the I think the best one I've ever had. Cause we don't have waves here in Georgia. We ain't got waves here. So I remember we went to Myrtle Beach, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I probably was. Cause I really didn't. I don't want to go too deep into the water. But I just I went. I want to say I went like, like, a little over knee deep. And I was literally just going out there just to look at the wave. And I was probably out there for like 15 minutes just watching the waves come in. Literally just watching the waves come in. I would watch them form or whatever, watch them crash, um, push the water back this way. And then I was watching people fish on the dock. Man, it was lit. I liked it. It was lit. Because we, we never see waves here. Like, we ain't got no beaches. We got a man-made beach, but I'm not going there. But I'm no, it'll all of finish this out. That's it. Oh yeah, but cause we don't really, we don't really go too many places. We don't really go too many places at all, man. But that's all for this video. 
Make sure you like the video. Comment more video ideas down below in the comment section, man. And as always, have a great day.